Welcome to Knockburn Nation. Welcome back, guys. Jarrell here. And I'm Josh. And today we have another Daryl Dixon video for you guys. Here to explain what the whole Daryl Dixon being the messenger delivering LeVron. Hopefully we got some more information on that. Maybe. Kind of. Kind of. Yeah. So that's one thing that we've seen. You know, we've seen in the trailer, the teasers where uh, they've mentioned that Daryl is a messenger and he, he needs to bring Laurent uh, somewhere. And we, it's kind of got a, you know, Last of Us style vibe in a sense. Now, the actor who plays Laurent, uh, apologize for mispronouncing the last name. It's Luis uh, Skizluzzi. Apologize for mispronouncing the name. So he teases the role just a little bit. So there was a walk. The Walking Dead released a short video featuring him teasing what to expect. He indicates that Laurent has lived all his life with nuns who are part of a group called the Union of Hope. Very cool. A uh, short clip of the show accompanying uh, Skaluzzi's interview sees Isabel calling Daryl a messenger who must deliver Laurent. Hi, I'm Louis Preschilozzi, and I play the role of Laurent. He's a little kid that lived all his life with nuns. I'm Ron, pleased to make your acquaintance. And it's the story about this man who comes from America, Dowell Dixon. You're the messenger. The messenger? To deliver Laurent. I have no idea what you're talking about. And uh, that's it. And that's it. Not really a reveal. <laughs> No, but, there isn't much there. No. Um, but what's interesting about that is that he we've and we've seen this before in like World Beyond and stuff like that, where yeah. kids that have been born and isolated have never been exposed to the outside world. Yeah, and that's what this is. Yeah. So the uh, the Daryl Dixon trailer previously hinted that Daryl's journey taking Laurent somewhere is an important part of the show's overall story. In the trailer, Isabel indicates Laurent will be important for somehow restoring the world back to normal. While it's not explicit about how Laurent is important, could it be possible he is somehow immune to the virus and could he be used as a cure? Who said that? Well, this is just kind of speculating. Okay. Yeah, All right. it's kind of speculating because she does mention, I remember her hearing her in the trailer saying restoring the world back to normal, but I didn't know she was talking about Laurent. Um. So what? how can Laurent restore the world back to normal? If they are doing a possible cure, that's very Last of Us. That is. <laughs> I mean, it's Last it, of Us. It is, so, it is from, from the aspect of, obviously, he, it's Daryl. He's taking the cure and trying to deliver it somewhere. Right. But I will say, to be play, kind of play devil's advocate here, I, even though I do not like that at all, mm -hmm. they did set it up in World Beyond that, and in The Walking Dead, very, very, very early, mm -hmm. that the French were the closest mm -hmm. to a cure. Yep, yep. So there is that. It's possible. There, there yeah. is that. Yeah. Maybe Laurent is the offspring of a scientist that was part of that group that was very close to finding that cure. That would be cool because yeah. it kind of states that he's lived all of his life with the nuns. So maybe... And where as a scientist would you stash someone... Exactly. <laughs> right. Yeah. This that's, union. This yeah. important to mm -hmm. you know important society. To, important to the world. World. Yeah. The scientist says, you know, you know, maybe the scientist was already dying. Something happened. They gave birth. Here, please take they my got son. Got sick. Got sick. Please take my son. You know, keep him safe. One day. Ooh, maybe they do the line. One day he will restore the world back to normal. Maybe they give that line. That would be pretty cool. I got goosebumps a little bit. Goosebumps yeah. there. Even, even though I, even though we've said, oh, it's a ripoff from The Last of Us, it's a different. It's of course a different perspective and a different theme. But um, so also, do you this, think she tells Daryl? Let's assume that that's right. Right. Do you think she tells Daryl how important he is? Probably not until the end of either. I would do say. Do you the think season? Laurent knows? No. 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 So, also, this villainous group um, are after, you know, after Daryl. But do you think this villainous group is after Laurent, and that's why they're after Daryl? Maybe this villainous group wants Laurent for some purpose. Maybe they know about his potential cure or something. No, I, I, I don't know. I'm or they want to use him for some some other evil reasons. Yeah. I'm still going to go of the belief that the, the group is somehow related to the guy that is killing scientists. From, from the uh, end from of World, World Beyond. Beyond yeah. I think because, again, we got... Um, oh, why am I forgetting his name? Not Nicotero. The, sh the showrunner. 
It's Gimple. Thank you, Jesus. Yeah, Scott Gimple. Uh, we got Gimple saying that that part of World Beyond will be involved in some manner in this show mm -hmm. but we don't know where we don't know if that's the variance we don't know if that's going to be maybe you know laurent right or this group that, that that is villainous that is you know obviously in world beyond killing scientists yeah. maybe that's related yeah i mean it's it it's very intriguing guys you know so that's that was one thing that we said when we heard this messenger thing is like what is the importance of this kid now they, you know, of course they didn't give us much detail as it is about this messenger because of course he's not going to spill the details <laughs> before the show comes out. But it is making us think that because he's been with the nuns all of his life, like Josh said, maybe his parents had a, a doomed fate and due to their experiments by the French and those teams, the Primrose and Violet teams were trying to fix the cure. Unfortunately, yes, they made it worse. But maybe something great happened with Laurent um, or with his mother. And when she gave birth, maybe he has something that they were working on. And, of course, they died before he could grow up. They gave him to the nuns, the Union of Hope, for safekeeping and for them to keep that secret. And now that he's older, it is now Daryl's task to deliver him maybe to other scientists who are in hiding working on something from roasting and they need his blood yeah or they need maybe not just his blood they need something to help restore the world back to normal yeah I, guys it's i'm getting more excited by the day yeah honestly absolutely. with more information coming out absolutely honestly I, I i can't think of why they they need him why he's so important but yeah. like this makes sense like and yeah it's <laughs> I, fitting it, it's the only thing that fits what, yeah. what else could it be off the top of my head, I can't think of anything else other than he is, he ha potentially has a cure. You know, we've kind of also, we've said before, and I think other people have written articles and other YouTubers have said, you know, do we really want a cure I don't for care. this universe? I don't care. You don't care? No. Either I, way? I, I, you know, either way, because at the end of the day, like we're, we, we have to get to the point where walkers don't mean anything anymore. Yeah. Um, now yeah. they've mixed that up <laughs> with the variants. Yeah. Uh, but in the source material, like eventually the walkers just died out, mm -hmm. uh, or it, most of them, most they, of them, they just to the point where they weren't anymore. a threat anymore. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And like, there's gotta be, there's gotta be some hope. Yeah. And, I mean, and that's could... what, that's what the cure brings. It brings hope. And, yeah. and d d I can't, I, I gotta believe that most of the fan base wants some type of happy ending. Yeah, and I think, you know, when we talk about Cure, um, there's a there's a movie that we want to eventually watch. Um, it's, it's called The Cure, and it's about uh, a zombie apocalypse that happened, and people who were zombies were actually cured and put back into society, right? So I think in this universe, I don't know if I want a cure to cure the, the, the walkers who are already walkers. Oh, no, 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 no. The That's not it. The cure is no. going to be for the living yeah. and the future of the world. Yeah. And as that happens, you know, where you don't turn when you die anymore, eventually all the roaming walkers around, there'll still be some in areas, but those numbers will begin to dwindle, 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 and it'll take decades before really walkers are truly gone because now everyone has the cure and you'll never turn again. So, I mean, yeah. I'd be fine with that. The the uh, the curing a walker that's already animated is not an option in this show, simply because, no. like, some of them are not going to come Far back. Far too gone. <laughs> <laughs> you imagine you that? You don't have your skin. <laughs> you don't have, well, you have teeth, but you don't have your skin anymore. You imagine anymore. going up to in Bicycle Walker and sticking a needle in, in, in her, her and yeah. being like, hey, you're cured. <laughs> Yeah, and some of those walkers that, you know, those variants that are burners, I mean, you just look at them. I mean, like, yeah. Yeah. So, I mean, a cure, I could deal with it for the living and the future. So, I mean, it, it does make sense. I know there's some fans out there that don't want a cure ever. You know, there's fans that are like that, which we get it. It's, it's the zombie universe. It's the walking dead. It's just what it is, because if you make a cure, then it's like, well, how do you make walkers really scary anymore? You, you know, don't. If there's a cure. You well, don't. 
you know, you make you turn it into well, something else. Well, I should stop that, right? You yeah. do. It's called burners. Burners, <laughs> r- the ones that run after you. Yes, like, the ones that can what's climb. What's out there already is still a danger. Oh yeah, um, for sure. It's just you got to cure. It's you're you're, you know. Think about how many people have died by ninja walkers. <laughs> <laughs> I'd love to compile that list. Like, they just think about that. Think about how many have died from walkers that have just been silent, and then all of a sudden they jump on you. you yeah, I, I, I want that list. That'd be sweet. No, I don't know. Somebody out there probably has. You know, somebody's got it. that. <laughs> They've already started it. <laughs> yeah, guys. So let us know your thoughts on this. Uh, we didn't get much information as far as the reveal of what the messenger is, but I think with these extra details, it is hinting towards Daryl has to take Laurent somewhere for it absolute high purpose and with it meaning restoring the world back to normal I think this kid has possibly the cure. You know I flipped right? I flip flopped. Yeah. In a previous video I said no I don't want that. Oh you don't want the cure? No in a previous video Oh you didn't want him to be I didn't want him to be the cure. Right right Yeah. see we opinions change when we learn new information and we talk about it. I want Rick Grimes to be the cure. I want well, Rick Grimes. To be the cure. Everyone, well, we wanted Judith to be the cure. <laughs> I'm joking. I do. RJ, <laughs> maybe Gracie. Yeah. All the kids are cures. Yeah. How about that? They all yeah. have it. <laughs> so yeah, let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Make sure you like, subscribe, share this out, and stay tuned. We are super excited to give you guys the reactions to the series. We are pumped. We are pumped. September Absolutely. 10th. Stay tuned. We'll see you guys in the next one. I'm Jarrell. I'm Josh. We're Nation. We're up. up.